What up, what up, what up, what up, what up, y'all? Yo. It's your boy, Mr. Monster Man Rocco, a.k.a. The Rockness Monster. I'm your host here with my co-host. It's the Rang One, the main gun, Captain African America with my favorite DJ. DJ Rec, what's happening with it? What's going on, y'all? Yeah. And this is Monster Mondays. You are now rocking with the best, y'all. We the best. We the best. Yo. Y'all just, just get familiar. I'm sure y'all agree later. What up, though? How's everybody doing? Doing great, man. How you doing? Oh. My brother's doing this shit. How are the people out there doing? Listening to people who watching this shit. What up to y'all too? All that. You know what we got to talk about is how on the presses right now. It's the verses. Right. It's the goddamn verses. I'm, I got to just jump. I, I'm going to just jump out the window and I'm going to politely shove DJ Rec under the bus. Go ahead. I'm going to politely, I'm a politely <laughs> just nudge him under the bus right now. Because <laughs> we just talked about this. Yeah, we yeah, just, yeah. You know, okay, we kind of we kind of okay. just talked about this, and Rec was like, you know, he thought that Kane was going to serve KRS One. Now, yes, I did. me and Starang. The yeah. rappers, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, throw that the, little tidbit in there, huh? Right, right. The rappers, you know, I think we were kind of on the same page, not word for word, yeah. but we were both really, we we, we, we probably we Kane fans. Like, I'm a, I'm a student of Kane and KRS One, but I favorite Kane, you know what yeah. I mean? But I was afraid for Kane, is what I was saying, you know what yeah. I mean? Uh, 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 Strang was just saying that Kane has no choice. He has no chance, right? And we went in back and forth about that. And Rhett was yeah. on the whole I, other side. I was of on the, the I was on I was on Kane's side. I, I believe that Kane was going uh, um, Merc uh, uh, KRS One. Uh, well, I might well, have well, been uh, a little presumptuous. Well, for for more reasons than one, I'm sad to say that you lost. You were, I mean, you yes, were wrong. Man. You were, you were wrong. You know what I mean? But one, I mean, because you know, Kane is Brooklyn, being one of yeah. the reasons. You know what I mean? Like I said, he was my, you know, my favorite of the two. You know what I mean? And so on and so forth. But I have an interesting perspective on it because when I first saw it, I didn't see it from the beginning, right? Yeah. I caught it from Who'd around. You catch the time. From around the time when Kane jumped in the crowd and shit and all of that, I was like, okay, uh, Kane, okay, okay, right? And so from that point on, somewhere around then I was watching, right? And from that point on, it just seemed like Kane was executing better than KRS-One. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? So so when I left that bat, when I left the verses, I thought Kane won until I yeah. rewatched it from the beginning. You understand uh, what I'm saying? And when you rewatch it from the beginning, KRS One was throwing haymakers from the jump. You know what I'm saying? And so it was more like it, it seemed more like you know the blowout game where the team that's losing kind of catches up at the end. You yeah. understand what I'm saying? That's kind of <laughs> what it was. You understand what I'm saying? But I can dig that. Yeah, but the the shit was it was it was dope. Still. Not to me, man. To me, KRS One had full control from the beginning to the. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I was glad to hear like them songs, man. The Big Daddy Kane songs, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like if that's, all that shit put me back in the time, man. But Karis One is just such a showman, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just, the stage I just feel show, like... his energy, the songs, you know what I'm saying? The motherfucking wit. The nigga was over there talking about, yo, y'all niggas running out of songs, nigga. That's what's going mm-hmm. on. Y'all niggas running out of songs, man. Y'all niggas trying to mm-hmm. stall, man. That nigga know, man. He know what he yeah. do, man. He know what he bring to the table, man. He's a killer. I just, he was just, I just killing felt like all night. You just killing. I, I just felt like towards the end of it, the KRS One execution was slipping for it. Like it was slipping. It's like he wasn't articulating his delivery. You know, I'm like, like you know, it, it was windy. You know, it's it's that conditioning and shit or whatever. You know what I mean? But I mean, like, the Kane, only thing Kane I would was, say, Kane was so only thing sharp I would say about to the end. Kane, what? He was so sharp all the way to the end. He was sharp. You know what I mean? Only thing I I would say about KRS One is that. He always did the um, let the crowd sing most of his words. Right, he kept oh, doing that yeah. too much. 
He did That's the only thing I would say. He did that too much. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. That that probably comes from performing a lot. Yeah. So he was performing to the crowd more like uh yeah. like he was on stage performing rather than like a versus. It's but like they all knew came... the shit though. They yeah, all knew yeah, the yeah. words though. I yeah, say that. Yeah. And I feel like Kane didn't do enough of that. Or he barely did that at all. You know what I mean? But It'd probably Kane be harder was, for Kane to do it because he raps so fast. Right. You know what I mean? But like what Kane but and but what Kane was doing was he was, you know, he was using that as his weapon, you know what I'm saying? Because he knew yeah. KRS, you know, that's not that that wasn't, you know, that wasn't in KRS's toolbox. And that shit yeah. was definitely a skill in itself for him to be doing them fast ass rhymes and jumping, literally jumping up and down, like jump, uh -huh. jump type of jumps. Like not just not just running around, literally jumping. He could have been doing jumping jack. He could he could have been jumping yeah. rope. <laughs> he could have been jumping rope just saying his raps. Just you understand what I'm saying? You and know not what? missing the beat. That shit was excellent. I I think Kane and Rakim would have been a better battle. Hi, I'm the Rockness Monster. Dopest voice in hip hop ever. Yes, ever. Ladies love my voice. You know what else ladies love? Ladies love cool shirts. And we got some of the coolest shirts you ever seen in your life over here. They don't shrink, they don't wrinkle, they don't fade. The best part about it is they feel good. Real good, I promise you. You put this shirt on, and women are gonna hug you different. We also got matching socks and neck gaiters for whichever shirt you order. Speaking of ordering, to order, go to rockmissbcc.bandcamp.com. Go there and have a blast. Knock yourself out. Rock on, rock on. Would have been rock him is the battle. Rock him is the battle that Kane always wanted, but I don't, I don't, I, I don't know for whatever reason it never happened. That would have been dope because both of them is pretty much the smooth brothers from back in the day. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. like everybody wanted to be Rock him or, or uh, Kane. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Dark skin niggas, anyway. You know. <laughs> that right there would have been dope. That would have been dope. Yeah, Kane been wanting that. Well, then, been wanting that the he been wanting that battle forever. Who would you have thought would have been a better contestant for KRS then? I don't know. I don't know. It's a good question. Yeah. Because he's a different kind know. of MC. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, that would have been good. L -L -L I don't know about that. You don't think so? J is a battler too, son. He's a battler. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, but versus is not really battling. That's what Kane treat. That's what that's what that's what uh, KRS One treated it like. That's what the Locks treated it like. That's what Jalen. Yeah, that's what the Locks treated. If, if those two had a battle, LL would have definitely beat beat KRS. He LL beat what? I said if he that said, had been the case, LL would have definitely beat KRS. And I'm not. Oh, you know, come I on now, Frank. Hold on, hold on, come on, hold on, hold on. I hold on. don't, I don't know. know. No, no, no. I gotta say it because look, LL literally though is a battle rapper. You know what I'm saying? And the dude got a ton of songs that everybody knows. Like I know I was wrong with with uh, with Kane, but I guarantee that if that had been the case, it would have been. You guarantee. I guarantee it. <laughs> Nigga. I don't think so, man. Really? You just not much yeah. of a KRS. I am a KRS one fan. fan. I like KRS one. KRS one. I don't I can't tell. I can't tell. <laughs> don't I don't paint me as a KRS hater. I'm sorry, I, I like Mr. KRS. I'm sorry, Mr. Blastmaster. You understand what I'm saying? I'm not even you know, I'm not, you know what I'm saying? I ain't even Forgive there. DJ Rex for, for his for, insulin. For, forgive me if that's that's how I'm but I, I'm just forget saying. forgive DJ Rex for being so blasphemous. That's our boy. First he from all, the west. He from the I'm, west coast. I'm a west coast dude. You understand so what I'm saying? Yeah. And I actually, I, when he came out here to perform, I actually got a chance to kick it with KRS. He's a very dope person. Like, I I like his music. He's dope. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, like, if we were gonna go versus and they were gonna be on stage performing against each other, I feel like that just would have been what that was you know what i'm saying but krs is dope so ll going what are you going to do i mean he got hits but his event i mean krs one got hits too you know what i'm saying yeah. and and what ll going to take off his shirt and that's supposed to just win the whole battle for right. that's what you're first to of all like, you know <laughs> that definitely wouldn't have been killer. the case. i know say? but ll got way KRS more one's a killer. krs 
is a killer. <laughs> a killer. Like, hold on. I mean, let's. I mean, and that's not to sleep on LL because he's he put he's put in his work in the game. You know what I'm saying? Not just. I mean, and so on some battle shit. He bad. He, he had it out with Modi, Ice yep. T. You know Cannabis. what I'm saying? Cannabis, yeah, he had it out with a few, you know, a few dudes. In. Yeah, and, listen, LL is dope. I'm an LL fan. Don't get me wrong. All right, yeah, you I'm know, he, like, he single handedly he like songs. took took cannabis out all the way, and he got better songs. He gonna have yeah. songs that people gonna know more than Kara's one. Yeah, mm. but that don't matter. Thank you for listening to Monster Mondays podcast. Please join us every Monday from 8 to 10 p.m. West Coast time and 11 to 1 a.m. East Coast time. Every single Monday, Monster Monday on the Dash app. Also, check out these awesome shows from the rest of our podcasting family. The Funny Farm, East New York Radio, All Elements Mix Show, The Star Power Collective, The Cosa Nostra Radio, 5150 Mix Show, Block News Live, Final Coffee Mix Show, and Hidden Gems. Check them all out under the delicious vinyl on radio stations.